Hey guys, today I'm going to show you my August favorites of the month. From makeup to hair products to nail polish and everything in between. I hope you guys enjoy and I apologize if my voice sounds weird. I'm currently sick and I'm trying my best to clear my voice throughout. But if I do sound weird, just bear with me, okay? Well, let's get started. Alright, so the first product I'm going to be sharing with you guys is the Neutrogena Acne Stress Control Face Wash and Focus? No? Alright, so it's the Acne Stress Control Neutrogena um, Paracream Wash and I've actually been using this for a while. I didn't just try it out this month. I probably used this product for like two years now. <clears throat> so I've repurchased it or like around 10 times in between. And this really helps keep my acne under control. And it doesn't dry out my skin either, which is, you know, great. Leave it on for about maybe two minutes while I brush my teeth to get it to really sink into my skin and you can feel like that little tingling sensation um, when it's you know getting into your skin so you can actually feel it working which is pretty cool um, so yeah this is definitely my go-to acne controlling um, face wash my second product is the lip balm by Nivea there we go. Okay, so it's the Nivea A Kiss of Milk and Honey Soothing Lip Care. Looks like this. It's just a little tube here and it has the yellow lip balm thing in it. I absolutely love this stuff. I'm, I actually have it on right now under my lipstick because I went to the lake yesterday and I forgot to apply lip balm and my lips are really sunburned and they hurt. But this stuff really helped um, soothe them. Um, as you guys see, I'm not done with it. It lasts a really long time. A little does go a long way with this. You don't need a whole lot. Um, yeah, there's also the blue one. Because I got this in a dual pack. I got this one and the blue one. Which is, I forgot what the like scent thing is. But I love this. This is my favorite lip balm to use. Definitely recommend, especially for the cold winter months that are coming. You definitely need to go and buy some of this because this stuff really does work. My next product is a hair product and it's the Itch E10 Miracle Leave-In product. Yeah, that's what it's going to be And this stuff is amazing. It works for so many different things. I'm actually almost done with it. It's like close to the bottom. And it does, it repairs dry damaged hair, it adds shine, it detangles your hair, controls, controls frizz, seals and protects hair color, prevents split ends, stops hair breakage, enhances natural body of your hair, and it's also a heat protectant for your, when you're using like your curling iron or your um, straightener or crimper or whatever you're using, it's also a protectant so it's helpful from all areas of the hair spectrum I love this stuff it doesn't weigh down your hair which I love because a lot of hair products out there um, like heat protectants and all that really weigh it down your hair and I hate that I hate feeling my hair is like you know greasy and weighed down and this doesn't do that it really doesn't weigh down your hair so yeah I love this stuff Next product is the Pravana, I believe, I believe that's how you say it. Pravana Intense Le Intense Therapy Leave-In Treatment. I can't talk today, like always. <laughs> this is a um, hair moisturizer. You spray it onto your hair after you get out of the shower, and it also helps to detangle it, which is an added bonus for me personally. My hair is so tangled when I get out of the shower; it's crazy. I have like balls of tangled hair everywhere. It's horrible. So without this stuff, I'd probably have no hair. Because <laughs> it's just so tangled after the shower. And this really helps to detangle it. And it also really does moisturize your hair. Um, it has a slight, um, what would I say? I 
guess you say scent or fragrance to it. Um, I don't find it annoying. It's very light. <coughs> it's not too bad, but it's still there. So, just so you know. And I am out of this, so I will definitely let you guys know where to get this if you do want to purchase it. Everything will be in the description box below, so check it out. Next product is a mascara, and I actually mentioned this in my Ipsy unpackaging video because I did get this as one of the products from Ipsy. Oh, come on. Yeah, but it's the Urban Decay Perversion Mascara, and this stuff is amazing. It really does lengthen your lashes. It's very, uh, very intense black, um, you know, formula. It's great. I really love this stuff. The brush is like so. You can see that. Maybe. Yeah. It's like this thick round brush, which helps with the volume and all that good stuff. I do have to wipe it a little bit before I use it because it has a lot of product on the brush and if I don't wipe it, it does clump my lashes together and I hate that, I can't stand that. But it really does do a great job, I love this stuff. And this is clumsy, clumsy, clumsy. <laughs> this stuff is actually the um, trial size, this isn't the full size. Um, I looked it online and it's a little bit taller, the actual tube. So, you know, you do get more for what you pay for. Um, I'll list all the information down below, price, where to get by it, all of that. So yeah, this is definitely my favorite mascara from right now. Next product is a tone correcting concealer from e.l.f. And it looks like so. Okay, this camera is not my friend today. Still not my friend. Okay. Alright, there we go. This is the e.l.f. Tone Correcting Concealer. And I actually have a love relationship with this concealer. Because, um, it's very good at brightening your under eyes. It does a great job with that, but I feel like it doesn't really help to, like, conceal acne or red spots and all that. I feel like it doesn't do that good of a job in those areas, but it does do its overall job, which is tone correcting. So I do recommend this if that's what you're looking for, but I don't personally recommend it to conceal stuff like pimples and red spots. I feel like that's not its strong area. Our next product is the ELF um, Healthy Glow Bronzer and I love this bronzer because it's very um, natural looking. It's not too dark to the point where you like you can tell, oh yeah, she's wearing bronzer. <laughs> but it's, you know, the perfect balance of color. should show you the inside. I totally forgot to do that. There it is. It's just this little like light brownish texture and it does have a it's not sparkly I'd say but it does have a slight shimmer to it you can't really see it like this but once you like apply you can sort of see it but once the day goes by you can't really notice it because it kind of you know fades away but yeah this is my go to uh, not concealer go to bronzer as of right now and of course I do have a nail polish of the month of course I love nail polish so I always try to include nail polish in my favorite videos this is the nice is nice shade by Essie this is really pretty like lilac color and I'm actually wearing it right now you can see it very pretty um, I got full opaque coverage from it in two coats, so it's a very good formula. And I'm personally not a huge fan of Essie products, but I really like this color, so I decided to give it a try, and yeah, I really do like it. I'm surprised. 
So yeah, this is definitely my favorite nail polish of the month. That's it for this month's August favorite video. I really do hope you guys enjoyed it. I will be back next month with even more products that I've tried out. And I'll give you guys, as always, an honest review of them. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel for a new video every week. See you next time. Bye. And that's it for this month's favorites video. Thank you so much for watching, everyone. I really do hope you enjoyed it. Um, I will be back next month with even more new products that I've tried throughout the month that I've liked and disliked. You know, that's the word of stuff. You know? Okay. Alright. And I'm scratching my nose. I don't know why. Okay. Alright, and that is the it. That is the it. Okay. And that is the conclusion of our July favorites. This sounds so specific. Let's try again. And that is the end of our 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 our, our brain fart. Ow. Okay. All right, and that is all for this month's 